Welcome back to Doom 3, or more so, we're playing Doom 3 Resurrection of Evil. This is an expansion pack, I have no clue about it, in fact, you know what, let's look it up on Wiki. I don't, I don't actually think Steam comes up on DX3. Pixels are a little bit weird. Oh well. Anyway, we could play this on Nightmare, but again, I haven't actually played this at all. So... We're going in completely blind, like, I haven't even played this thing. I'm assuming it takes place after the events of Doom 3, but it's probably like the, oh yeah, by the way, you gotta kill the, the guy now. Or something, I don't know. But, uh, other than that, though, Doom 3. Yeah, so I'm recording this just after I, I beat uh, the actual game. It's for some odd reason I decided to cut the sitting and then the next part is the last part. But anyway, November 15, 21.5. UIC's Mars Research Base suffered a catapult mechanical failure during a classified research experiment resulting in total destruction of the facility. Only one survivor is located. Oh, that's kinda cool. Feel like the last guy. May the first. An orbital pro records a faint unidentified signal broadcast from the abandoned Mars Site 1 complex. The UIC announces the renewal of its Mars Research Program. Or, Elizabeth McNeil is driven. Oh, that's Doctor, not War. It's Software Presents. Ah. Dr. McNeil. Whoa, frame rate. Red Team, we're showing your position less than 100 meters from the signal. But there's no data suggesting any ancient civ development in that area. I think they're up to something they just don't want us to know about. <laughs> Some things never change around here. What's going on with the frame rate? There you go. That's a little bit. There you go. That's better. It's still at 50 though. At least it's not going to be picked up and the recording is bad. Now it's on 27. What's with the lighting? Explosion. What's with the frame rate? I don't know what's going on with it. Doctor McNeil, are you seeing this? We have reached target and are now preparing to secure. We're having trouble with your transmission. I need that stream brought back online now. Damn it! Can't see a thing. They might hear you. Do you hear that sound? What the hell is that? Look at that. Take off the helmet because that will obviously help you see. Open the ark. <laughs> Whoa, gosh. Hell reaches out for what is ours. We have been unbound. They have arrived, my children. As I promise, rise up. Awaken. It's kind of awkward. It's like holy snap. Stand at the top of the mountain. What? <laughs> it's a human heart. Our new reign begins now. <laughs> Wait, hold on. <laughs> yeah, good. That sensitivity, I'm gonna need that. Oh! Uh, uh, uh. Okay. 
It's a human heart. What the hell just happened? Oh gosh. I don't know what that was. Did I make the Lost Souls look more like Lost Souls? Cause that's pretty cool then. Remove the power. What's up? Oh, hello. Ah. Yeah, good. Don't tell me I have to watch that again. I'm gonna have to watch that again, don't I? Dude, it just made the same inventory sound as Doom did. Boom, boom. Like that kind of sound. So anyway, yeah. So, so yeah. This is an expansion pack to a to a sense. It's not like you know. Okay. It's kind of cool. How cool. the guy in the in the main game was like the guy standing back there. Oh, that's not good. Jump! Go, 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 go! Where is he at? Oh, there he is. Oh, I missed. There you go. Oh, they look more like Lost Souls now. He's just kind of there. I'm actually kind of intrigued because we're not on the space base. Yes, I do have all the same weapons, I know, but... Hey, we're not on the space base anymore. So at least it's something different. <laughs> oh, yeah. Oh yeah, because they've got to condense the game down to a third of its length, pretty much. That. Dude, I was thinking it was like, oh yeah, turn on the power. Kind of like that, but nope. That's not what they are. Head. <laughs> All right, I better stop sprinting because that's that's just gonna bite me in the back. Ah, that was convenient. Ledge. That was a convenient thing that just broke. Well, it's a door. Oh. Now I can apparently sense that some guy is like roar. I would like to get one of those gravity guns. Hey, the gravity gun does that. He was like, oh no, I fell over. He tried to hit me with a fireball, but I grabbed it and threw it right back at him. Yeah! You're not gonna get far with that pistol. Take this grabber. It's more useful than you think. Yeah, but I've got a shotgun and a machine gun. <laughs> Apparently, some guy could get that far. Alright, so what is this? Grabber. So basically, yeah, we've got a gravity gun now. Oh joy. Gravity gun. Does it have ammo? No, it doesn't. I was thinking, hmm, it's got the screen. Has a little bit of a charge, but I'm cool with that. Oh, what do you know? <laughs> it's gonna be like the Soul Cube, isn't it? It's just an easy way to kill all the enemies. Just pick them up, chuck them in the wall. Yeah, it's like the gravity gun at the end of a uh, Half Life 2, and the re and the way they um the way they made it challenging was that they just sent so many guys at you while trying to incorporate puzzles and stuff. Yeah, my frame rate could be better. But alas, woe is me. Cool. 
Quick. Get up. Get up. You sure there's not a less efficient way of using it? Because I'm I can just go boom, pick you up, drop you oh, boom, pick you up, drop you. At least I'm not getting health for it. Okay, thank goodness it only applies to realize yeah it applies to them as well well then again I think it's good that they managed to incorporate a bit of an interesting way to add a new item also I could pick up rocks I could pick up that rock and chuck it out well it's not really that good now You technically do a grappler only a grabber only run of this game probably. I don't know though. I haven't seen the rest of the game. I'm only in the first map. I believe there's 12 maps in this game, and most of it takes place in here until we move on to the next map. And there was probably some items around there. <laughs> Whoops. Okay, so anyway, we're on level two of the 12 maps. Yeah, it's definitely a lot shorter, because why would you make an expansion that's longer than the actual game itself? San Andreas. Nah, that's not an expansion. Yeah, again with the frame rate, I don't know what's going on with it. Why can't, why can't I hold the artifact and... Just casually... In either hand. Um... Hold on, what's going on? What is going on in the world today? Okay, I guess I'm just going. Here we are. Check the pickaxe. There's no alt fire. I like how it bends light, that's pretty cool. Look at that. Whoa, that is, that is pretty cool. Oh, oh, that, okay, okay, I, I get it. So basically, it's like the gravity gun, except you are... There's a limit. There's a there's a little bit of a time limit on how long you can hold things, pretty much. Alright, that makes sense. It's weird though, because gravity gun, you can't use it with everything, although the gravity gun also did that, so... Set things on fire when you threw them. I can just kind of push it out of the way. Hmm. I feel like I'm going to be using this quite a lot. Although I guess, yeah, this entire level pack, it's going to kind of be based around doing puzzles with this or something, right? So I guess I got to go up the stairs. Interesting. Oh, uh, grenades. Yeah, yeah, I totally used tons of grenades <laughs> in the um, original game. I feel like I've been to this area before. So red. Ooh. Oh. oh, that works. You just kind of do that. That's why. I mean, like that's pretty cool. That's pretty cool. That's pretty cool. Don't be over analytical. That is cool. The stairs broke. There's an enemy somewhere. Oh yeah, so I've got the PDA and now the ceiling is shaking and holy snap, it's the guy from Alien. Thankfully they've given a new enemy. Can I do that? Yes, I can. Yup. I'm guessing he'd deal more damage because his, his projectile is blue and the Guardian's one was blue. But again, like... Oh, I guess he ducks, but... Again, like, he just chucks a projectile, shoot it back at him, that's it. I don't even, I can even hold down this button, I don't have to time it well. I can pick up the spiders! I... I can pick up the spiders! Also, there's a lot of times where it's just taking me out here. Uh, 
snap. Oh, thank goodness. There's a turret. Ah. Uh, is, is it a little bit too soon for this? Wait, hold on. He hasn't got any legs. He can teleport. Watch me teleport. Ah ha 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 ha. I'm guessing, what do I do? I pick up this projectile, chuck it back at him. Oh. Is this a boss? Kind of interesting way to present a boss. Also, are those things shooting at me, or are they just... Okay, that, that was just... Oh snap! Now I have infinite sprint again. I think I think I should be picking up that and then chucking that at him. Oh yeah, that's how I do it. Oh, now he's teleporting. Teleport, Mario. It's up there. Oh, I missed. See, I can't see like where it will crap. See where he is if he does that. Teleports and I've got to, I've got to manage to hit him. Oh come on, that totally should have hit him. Ah, oh. well, that was a pretty fun boss. Wouldn't you agree? This fight has only just begun. Okay. What? Listen carefully. This isn't the first time you're facing this, but I need more information. Uh, did it just say like hell time? The artifact to recover this obviously capable of incredible power may also be the source of this invasion. Do whatever it takes to get the artifact to me. I'll try to contact the others. Alright. So I'll just use the grabber again. Wait, wait, so what do I do? I wave this over dead bodies and then my hands. Oh god, that's just creepy. What's going on with my hands there? That is pretty creepy what's going on with my hands there. Anyway, I think I'll end it off here. I'll see you guys next time on. ROE.